gonna go over ascending on our ascenders. First thing we do is we approach our rope set. Um, we're gonna put on our belay first. Put on our belay first, take our belay off last, like we're always on belay. Take my belay device, function test it. It's working correctly, I'm good to go. Next, I'm going to load myself on the main line into my chest ascender. Take up the rope, go up on my tippy toes and take up slack onto the rope. Once I'm good there, I'm going to put on my handled ascender. Put on my handled ascender, and then I'm going to sit down into it. Take up a little more slack, sit down into it, and I'm going to take all the swing out of the ropes. One thing we see often with students is they're, they're swinging as they're going up, and when they're swinging, it's not slowing down. You want to come over here, get directly underneath your lines, and stop any swinging, okay? When I go to ascend, I'm taking my foot, and I'm putting it underneath my butt, I'm trying to stand straight up. I'm trying to stay vertical and not be leaning out here because it makes it a lot harder on my arms if I'm going up that way. So try to stay vertical. I take my foot, put it underneath my butt as I stand. If I need to, if I need both legs, I can take this foot and I can put it on top of my other foot as I stand up and go as well. My chest, I'm keeping my chest nice and tight into the crawl as I go up. Again, trying to stay nice and vertical in the vertical plane as I go. And my hands, my hands, what I like to do I put my hand actually behind my handle lace under, not on the handle. And the reason being is if I'm like this, it's a lot harder on my arm, my bicep, and you're gonna gas out by day two or three in class because you're putting a lot of strain on that bicep tendon. So I put my hand up here, it's a little more straight, and I put my other hand up actually above on the rope. And again, trying to keep myself vertical as I go. And the other thing, the last thing I'm gonna do when I go up is I'm gonna go slow. I'm going fairly deliberate and slow as I go up. I'm not trying to, Jump, I'm just letting it feed through. The faster you go, the more jumpy you are. The rope tines tend to bunch up and doesn't feed through as easily, okay? Again, it's nice and easy as I go up and I stand. Keep going up, okay? The other thing you can do, which we do very often on job sites especially, is we have a foot ascender. So, we have a foot ascender, Harkin Ninja foot ascender. What we can do is we can use both legs together and A stand up like this, again, in a frog type method. Or eventually, once you get better with technique, you can stand up on it and try to go vertical and walk up the rope 